<laughs> One more appointment first. We'll talk about your impressions of the fight tonight. Um, well, with Misha and Kat, I mean, I, it kind of went the way I expected. Kat looked a lot better in the workouts. Misha is usually the type that really fights above herself in competition, which is one of her better attributes. So, um, you know, Misha looked really good. I thought this, the fight was stopped maybe a little prematurely. But, I mean, Kat looked amazing, too. You know, I don't want to take anything away from her. She was lighting her up. And, you know, if Misha wants to complain, the fight should have been stopped, that she shouldn't have been in that situation in the first place. So, um, yeah, I was really impressed with Kat tonight. I saw a lot of things that um, were helpful, so I'm glad I come, came and saw it live. And, yeah, I'm looking forward to talking, man. It's going to be cool. You mentioned you wanted to coach against Misha because you thought it would be good TV and a little bit fun. I think you just wanted to mess with her a little bit, too. Yeah. But uh, now that's not the case, what do you think about uh, facing Kat and, and being across from her? Uh, well, I always said that the, the fight that I wanted the most was Kat. So um, I'm, I'm glad that we're actually going to be fighting. And um, on the show, you know, you never know. It would have been, I, I think I would have enjoyed tormenting Misha. Uh, whereas, you know, Kat seems pretty cool. But, I mean, I don't really know her at all, but she seems cool. And, um, it, yeah, it's going to be cool regardless. Regardless of who I'm coaching against, it's such a unique and historical situation, which seems to be coming up a lot these days. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it's going to be awesome regardless. I saw a lot of people on the internet saying there's no way either one of these girls could hang with Rhonda. Um, did you take that impression away at all, or did you feel like do you feel like she's going to be a worthy adversary? Um, I mean, technically, Kat has a better record than I do right now. She's she's eight and um, seven and zero, oh, and um, I know, who is it? it? Was like Rashad and Leoto that were only two undefeated people fighting for the championship before. So this is something very uncommon and very special, and um, I'm happy to be part of it. And I always think of myself as the underdog, regardless of uh, what other people think. Sorry. Did you see anything with the submissions that Misha was trying to use to finish Kat that maybe sparked your eye as far as uh, Kat's submission defense? Um, yeah, there were some things that uh, Misha could have done better, that she was in some really good positions that she could have capitalized on um, a little better than she did. But um, it's easy to say that looking from the outside, you never really know. But um, yeah, if I was in a similar situation, I would think that it would have ended differently. Uh, did you hear